Okay, so here we have the Shopify motion theme and we've gone for the classic view. So you can see we have uh, great use of visual storytelling straight away and bold text. So this theme is really about um, showing off your brand through images and video. So you can see right at the top, we've got this great simple drop down menu. You can see that. And then we scroll down. You can introduce a little about your brand here. Then we have top product picks here. Great thing you see, you hover over the image and we change the image here. Now, one of the really cool things about this theme is that you can click on this one, quick view. And then you see you have a quick um, summary of the products, which is uh, without having to leave the home page, which is really useful, quick way to browse. Okay, so we can have a look at that. It's just very simple. You can add to cart here. You can either click the cross or we can just click off here. Okay, so we scroll down a bit further. We have here, we're showing off a collection. So we can have either a seasonal collection or just a individual collection. Like we have here show tops, show women's clothes. This is a really great theme for um, fashion stores, clothes stores. Although you could use it for any store really, but very good for fashion stores. Okay, so we have some more very bold image here. This isn't actually video content. This is actually just videos that are being uh, pulled out to make it look as if it's uh, more in motion, which is really, if you, if you don't have the time or perhaps the money to uh, produce high quality video content, because it does take time, uh, then this is a really simple way to make your store feel more alive. So definitely consider that. Go down here, we have support for gift cards. Um, you could probably change this to highlight another product or collection, but they've chosen to uh, show off the gift cards. This is a new feature, uh, well, an old feature, but one that is now available for all Shopify plans. Uh, so that's, you can get that as a gift. Come down a bit more, we have another great example of uh, using imagery. Kind of very bold um, to show off the different collections. Then we go down here, we have uh, another uh, highlighting more products. We can see again, you hover over and we're changing the image. We have the quick view again, we have different color variations down here. Oops, let's go back. Okay. And then this one great use of um, just a short video to show the product in a bit more detail. Um, definitely something that you could take some inspiration from. Okay, different sizes here. Nice bold call to action. So you can see this theme really, even on a homepage, we're already really um, have so much potential to uh, highlight products, collections, and really show off uh, some detail through uh, visual uh, visual input. Have again here. So this is a, a blog article. You can put here. Great uh, picture. We go down. We have a bit more from this. This is great. This um big bold map to um give a bit more context. If you have a brick and mortar stores, uh, then that's great. Scrolling down to the footer, we have room for four, uh, four pillars here. So we can put um, some collection links, a bit more um, information about the store. Maybe you could put your private policy, return policy as well, anything like that. Subscribe to a newsletter. See down here, we have the option to change the currency as well, which is very nice. Okay, so now let's move on to a collection. Let's say we'll go to uh, men's shirts, okay. And we're just going to have a look through. So we have a nice uh, picture here. 
And we go down. As you can see, we have the changing image as well when you're hovering over. It's changing the image. We have the option to bring that quick view up again. Scroll through the different ones. So it's really quick and easy to add products to a cart, which is definitely a way that you can increase your conversion rate. We have here, we have size charts. It's a really great resource um, comparing different countries sizes because um, that can get a bit confusing. We have here, you can ask questions. Um, you could also integrate a live chat feature. Uh, they haven't actually got that on this example theme, but you could do that to make um, to allow customers to ask questions a bit quicker. Okay, so let's pick out this coastline T. Let's have a look here. So this is now the product page. So now we've got a more detailed um, product page than just a quick view. As you can see, the top part is actually the same as the quick view. But then when we scroll down, we have the option to integrate customer reviews here. A really great way to build social proof, also a great way to actually um, improve your website's SEO. Come down, we can um, have use more images here and some text just to tell off the story, uh, brand story, the product story. Maybe go into a bit of detail here about the uh, materials used or you know anything else that's important to your product, really stand up features. Uh, here we carry on. We've got more text and images to just, you know, great looking uh, layout to show off a bit more of the products, new angles. Very nice kind of almost minimalist theme here with the um, with the white sections between the product images. We scroll down some more. We have a video here where we can really show some more information um, about the product. So again, really focusing on, on the visuals, video content, really a theme for any merchant that wants to um, use visual storytelling to really show off their products and their brand. So we come down, we have room for testimonials as well. Very useful. And then more images kind of showing off the kind of brand feel um, so this brand is a kind of outdoors, adventurous, uh, clothing brand. So, you know, we've got these pictures here of, of, um, outdoory, adventurous people. Okay. We go back we come down and then here, perfect. We have opportunity to upsell some different items, um, things that customers might also be interested in based on their shopping experience. Again, we can quick view these ones. Really easy way to build up the average order value. Okay, and then we can either go back to the collection or we can go here, we can go to the next product. Keep scrolling through um, all the different products. So again, the same um, potential for you know, using video content image content, animation, and, you know, really uh, bold, engaging text. So let's look at some of the other pages. We have um, some more static pages, like our story, the about me page. Uh, so this is where you can, again, use more uh, pictures here. We have a kind of a slideshow of images here uh, to show off the brand history and the kind of brand um, personality here, which is Great for bringing in customers, giving them a, a sense of, of who you are. It's actually a very short about us page, but it just talks about the um, history of the brick and mortar stores, which gives a bit more grounding to it. We have this nice big bold map as well. So if you have, um, if you're a store that has physical locations, you know, you can see that this is a really great way to uh, actually show off those locations a bit, as well as uh, as well as show off your products online. Again, here we we have some more um, upselling some certain items here, and then some more images. 
So this is just one of three themes. Um, we have classic, we also have, I think, elegant and one other. So I'm gonna come in here to the uh, main features. We'll just kind of have a run through here. So as we saw on the product pages, you know, you have plenty of sections uh, to show off images, videos, and so on. We have actually 12 or more sections available for that. Great use of eye-catching animation, video content, images. You can have multiple layouts to suit your brand. You know, if you want more information or if you want to keep it simple and minimalist, you can do that. We have instant sub collections, so you don't even have to leave the page um, to see more products in a subcategory. And of course, being really important in 2020, it's optimized for mobile first, which is uh, very important considering most, I think about 84% of Shopify customers are using mobile. Um, so definitely need to be optimizing for that. And another great thing here, really kind of social proof going on, it's made by ex Shopifyers. So if you've used Shopify before, you probably know about the debut theme and the Brooklyn theme, two of the most popular Shopify themes. And uh, this one is actually designed by the same people who made those themes. So you know you're getting um, really great designers on this theme. So you can count on it to uh, be optimized for your store and to not have any glitches and yeah, you know you're in good hands. So as you've seen, yeah, we have room for beautiful imagery, clean, minimal design, um, it's optimized for readability. You know, these are all things I think you can, you can tell just by looking at the, um, the example store. What I really want to point out, we've looked at the way that the page transitions and the quick view product, quick view, that's like a really nice, clean way to change the pages that sort of makes the whole store feel a lot more, um, tied together. You know, we have support for YouTube integration, MP4, Vimeo, um, so different types of product video. So on the homepage, we have, I mean, you saw the homepage, so you know what we have. We have free hero sections, which is great. We have collection callouts. We can showcase um, products or collections that you want to highlight. Okay. So we go through here, we've seen the collection pages, we've seen the product pages. Okay, so here we have um, plenty of stuff to increase the conversion rate, like quick shop, pop out cart, integrated reviews. Uh, this is a new one, frequently asked questions template. What I actually want to focus on is, okay, here we have the plenty of great features to support your blog your um your content which is obviously really important for your seo so that's great yeah so you can see you have tons of features here to help your store uh, to help your seo to help your design and to really make a store that is designed to you know really catch the visitors attention really um bring them into your brand so this is the classic version of the motion theme and this isn't a free theme. It costs $180, um, which, you know, might sound expensive to some of you, but then at the same time, if you are a business who really is taking, uh, the movement online seriously, then $180 for a theme like this is, it's definitely not too much in the long run, you know, for the kind of theme you're getting, the kind of features, uh, and the support is actually quite a good price. I mean, if you were to pay a web developer to design your website, it would cost you a lot more than $180. So, um, so yeah, definitely, uh, quite a good price. I think for this theme, as we've seen, it comes with loads of great features. So if you're a new brand, particularly if you're selling, um, products that you can really show off at different angles, really visually show off. Uh, then this is a great theme for you. If you're showing off, uh, sorry, if you're selling services, may, maybe this isn't as good a theme. It's, it's really 
depends if your service can really be captured on video, but I'm sure it can. So yeah, so that's our uh, quick review of the Shopify motion theme. I hope